This is the day the Lord has made. We will rejoice and we will be glad in it. It's Julius Sully here and I welcome you to a week of God's abundant prosperity. The scripture says in Psalms chapter 37 verse 25, I have been young and now I'm old and I have not seen the righteous forsaken nor his descendants begging bread. The challenges of life can sometimes make us feel forsaken. At a point, Jesus had to cry on the cross, my God, my God, why have you forsaken? shaking me. But you see, God's word promises us that he will never leave us nor forsake us. No matter the situation or circumstance life has thrown at you, always remember that God is on your side. He is for you and never against you. And I pray for you this week that as you step out, you will feel the warm embrace of the Lord and you will be reassured of God's plan and purpose for your life in Jesus' name. I declare that every situation, every circumstance and every end of us of yours this week is working together for your good in the name of Jesus. I say to you that you shall go out with joy and be led out with peace in Jesus' name. The days of receiving negative reports, I say they are over in the name of Jesus. Only good news you will hear from afar and from near because God is working for you. He will walk in you, walk through you this week in Jesus' name. I declare to you that whatsoever you lay your hands on to do this week, prospers doors of opportunities and divine provision is yours in the name of jesus you will not have to beg for bread and none of yours will have to beg in jesus name i say to you you are not alone god is with you this week he has gone ahead of you to prosper your way in jesus name please share this with as many as you can and i see you walking in the newness of god's love in jesus wonderful name god bless you and i'll see you around